Many of us are watching what we spend in these tough times, but one out of two consumers say that they won't cut back on brands that support good causes. And we found such socially conscious consumers in a tiny Atlanta restaurant. Georgia farmer Rashid Nuri picked the collars this morning at his farm just 16 kilometers away. David Sweeney will serve them tonight at his Atlanta restaurant. The food is so fresh it still has a pulse. The tiny five-table dynamic dish is part of a growing nationwide dining trend, serving fresh-picked food, grown organically close by, and delivered with a small carbon footprint. The quality is what, you, what you're getting, and, and the cost to the economy and the environment is less. The restaurant's commitment to the environment goes beyond its food ingredients. The establishment has earned a Platinum LEED certificate, granted for exclusive use of green technology and recycled materials. The dynamic dish has energy-efficient heating, reuses rainwater and food scraps, and even its furniture is recycled. My chairs are from the thrift store. The tables have been are recycled, recycled baker's tables. Uh, these uh, marble tops on the counter here used to be in the W Hotel. Sweeney's restaurant is developing a following of dedicated customers who are still willing to pay extra to eat here, despite the bad economic times. The food is good, but they're also supporting a worthy cause, local green business practices. You could still go to a fast food place and, and pay half the price. Probably less than half the price. I'm less than half. But in the long run, you're going to pay for it in obesity or cholesterol or, or all sorts of things. And I'm not going to feel good about it. <laughs> And I'm not going to be supporting a local business, I'll be supporting a chain. The Dynamic Dish customer is the new socially conscious consumer. The Good Purpose survey, which follows global consumer trends, finds nearly 7 in 10 people are willing to pay extra for eco-friendly brands. Atlanta's Dynamic Dish is part of a growing global trend of consumption with a cause, as more people tie their own well-being to the health of their environment. And here's some more information about the changing face of consumption. The annual Good Purpose study also finds that more than 80% are willing to change consumption habits for a better future. 55% say they will pay extra for a brand that supports a good cause, even in a recession. 76% globally like to buy brands that donate to worthy causes. 68% say they remain loyal to a brand if it supports a good cause. This new trend has me blogging. You can check my blog, Consuming with a Conscience, at cnn.com slash